Okay, great Bridget. What I'd like you to do is to move your left hand and watch what's happening in the mirror. Great. And now can you follow that with your true right hand? Does it feel a bit strange? Mm, it feels a bit strange. Okay, we're working a good map there. Brilliant. Thank you. Hi. Did you know that rehabilitation of injury often uses a lot of brain training? Hi, I'm Jay Gilbert from Peak MSK Physiotherapy and I'm a specialist musculoskeletal physiotherapist. Our brains contain a map for all our movements and all the purposes we put into that movement, whether we perform sports, play an instrument or just get into the car the usual way we do. However, when we have an injury and it persists, these brain maps may become smudged and therefore our bodies don't have a reference point in the brain to move properly and comfortably. And that's where graded motor imagery is a very good strategy of brain training that's used currently at our clinic and is well sourced in the literature as being effective. It consists of a three-step process of differentiating between left and right, which our brain maps may have trouble with. Then it consists of using imagined movements or imagined sensations. This mental imagery is very important. And finally, we buttress that using mirror therapy where we present a reflection of a healthy limb to shadow the recovering limb and trick the brain that it's safe to move the injured part. And this can be very effective and useful, giving good results.